would never run a 5K. What about this, this guy? This guy would talk about it. May even sign Ed? up. Hello. Do you want to run a 5K? <laughs> Maybe next week. Okay. <laughs> That's those people. <laughs> as hard as it is to look at these photos, I mean, it's easier knowing that we're not these people anymore. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I saw how he was eating properly and exercising every day and being consistent. I know that you worked out six days a week and here I was doing nothing. You know, I was gaining weight while you were losing weight. <laughs> you lost, what was your final? Uh, 60 something, 67, 65. And here I was at my heaviest <laughs> and frustrated, so unhappy with my weight. I knew she was looking for something and I recognized something that I was feeling the same way before I had, I had done X3. Watching you go through the journey, it was, inspirational to me. It was a complete transformation. I mean, you completely did a 180. You basically carved a path for me, and I followed it. I shattered 20 pounds, 30 pounds in the first two months. So then I was like, oh, OK, let's, let's see where this is going right? to go. I'm down 71 pounds. That's crazy. That is a small child. <laughs> We're good influences on each other now and not bad influences. <laughs> I just want to pay it forward. I want this to be a domino effect. I want one person to see this and be like, I can change just like she did. I got healthy and fit and lost 68 pounds, and my success motivated Jamie. And I lost 81 pounds and two rounds of P90. Health can be contagious, too, if you can't forward. I do, that you can make me. Um, I had to miss out on all that, and I, I felt like a failure. I felt um, like I couldn't provide for my family, and, um, and this beach body opportunity was there, and uh, I was thinking about what it could be like if there was something I could do, and as I was researching it, um, I realized that it was very possible just to make even a couple hundred dollars a month at start, and I started thinking about what a couple hundred dollars could do for me for my family, like I, I never wanted to feel the way I felt again. I never wanted to send my family away where I couldn't afford to, to go with them again. You know, and another really concerned thing that I had, I just don't know a lot of people. I wasn't on Facebook that much. I farm for a living. I spend most of my days like in tractors or out in the fields by myself. I'm not in contact with a lot of people. But I found as I started to share my struggles and stories, people that I haven't talked to in years were reaching out to me. And by me just sharing what I was going through, I was inspiring people even though I wasn't directly communicating with them. And it began to grow, it began to get bigger. And Now in just a couple months, I've I have enough money where we got a Disney trip planned. That's in the works. Uh, we ha I'm dreaming again about big things through the business. I get my picture taken with Tony Horton and Autumn Calabrese at Summit, which is a trip coming up in July, and I get invited to exclusive party. I have had unbelievable success, and she's reaching out to you to have that same success. So if you're watching this video. Christine thinks you should be a coach. I would love to meet you. I would love to be the people that Christine believes in. I want to be part of that. We have this awesome team. You don't have to do it alone. You don't have to have all the answers. You just need to have a passion. If you have a passion, you need to sign up as a coach and help us help reach other people.